Alrighty y'all, y'all know what time it is. It's time for another boot review. And today I have the latest and greatest, the most recent limited release. And this is another version of the Nolan, which is a lizard boot. And this one is in the Canyon Relic colorway. So it's supposed to be a boot that has like a distressed rustic look. The shaft is supposed to be brown on them. And um, I really like the images that they released on their official Instagram account. And I picked them up. So this is going to be the first time I get a real good look at these boots because all I did was glance in the box. And I also bought a matching belt. And also, Tacovas is giving away free boot socks right now. So let's get right into it, you guys. So here we have the Canyon Relic colorway belt that's supposed to match up perfectly with these new pair of boots. And you can choose from two belt buckles. This is like their more uh, brass or rustic looking belt buckle, um, which you can easily swap out. I actually have a belt buckle that runs about $25 or so, maybe even less. And boom, guys, just like that. Check this out. You have a nice lizard skin belt with a belt buckle to match your new pair of boots. So we're gonna put this aside for a minute and get right into unboxing these boots. Another thing that Tacovas typically adds in their boot box is a koozie for your cold beverage. So that's a real cool thing that they do. And let's show these goodies right here. Boot socks, belt, koozie, and here are the boots. This boot features a 12 inch shaft, a lizard skin vamp, a leather sole, and an inch and a half leather stack heel with lemon wood pegs and a few brass pegs in here as well. This is typical construction for Tacovas, and Tacovas, without even trying these on guys, I can honestly tell you that these boots don't really require any break-in period. Um, that's kind of why I've stuck with Tacovas, and most of my boots are Tacovas boots because of that. Because, you know, ever since I started buying them, I just like the way that I could just throw them on and my feet would not hurt at all. And most of these boots, if not all of them, fit about the exact same size uh, for me or fit the exact same way for me. So I don't ever have to size down, change any sizes. And that's really cool because these are handmade boots. So they're all gonna feel and fit just a tad bit different, but they're pretty consistent on how they make their boots and I like that about them. The only boots that I've actually seen that deviate from these are actually like their actual riding boots. They kind of run a little bigger. So other than that, these boots fit relatively the same. So if you buy a lizard skin boot and you want to try an alligator one or an ostrich boots from Tacovas, they're going to fit almost exactly the same. And that's really what I like about this boot brand. And that's really what I like about these boots because I don't have to break them in and I just, and they're comfortable. I literally wear these boots like if they were sneakers. Uh, my feet don't hurt or anything like that that you hear from, um, you know, other folks or other boots, which I, I honestly have other pairs of boots, which I'm looking forward to showing you guys in the future. I actually have some other boots signed up that I really, really want to show you guys. So that's going to be pretty cool. So stay tuned for that. And let me know, guys, in the comments down below. What do you guys think about these boots? Do you guys like them? I think they're really sharp looking. I honestly wasn't sure about these boots because I have another pair of relics. The original relics. And you guys may have seen that on my YouTube shorts. They actually have a darker, uh, almost black, grayish, and distressed and rustic look on the shaft. And um, they're really nice, but the brown tone on these 
and just the way everything looks on there, man, these are really sharp looking. I'm really impressed by these boots and how they look. So, you know, like I was telling you guys, we, we're basically seeing these boots at the exact same time. And you can see how consistent they are. The, the lines on here run straight down the middle. The back looks really sharp. And the thing about these boots, the lizard that Tacobas decides to use for these boots is an actual bigger type of lizard. And the reason that they go with that is so that they don't have to have any uh, extra cuts in the vamp. You know, like there's boots that you may have a cut that's coming through here or you know you'll see like a different type of pattern uh, somewhere along the lines where they get stitched and you don't have that with these boots they're real consistent looking i'm really really impressed uh, by the craftsmanship the cording looks amazing on here as always this is their typical cording on these boots and I actually am going to have another boot to review for you guys and it's really going to be a similar version of this boot because they made this boot in three different uh, styles. The round toe that you see here, a snip toe, and then a sip of boot. So stay tuned guys because I'm going to have another pair. I bought a different style for you guys to check out. So be on the lookout for that video and that's going to be coming soon because I wanted to get these on video for you guys to check out as soon as possible because, you know, they're a limited release. So they're gonna be running out of these. Um, there's some sizes that are already sold out on their website, but there's some still available. And be on the lookout if you really want these boots because what happens is some people buy them, they don't like the sizing or the style may not be for them and they'll return them or exchange them or whatever the case may be and that may be the perfect opportunity for you to buy them in case you missed out on the initial uh, release for these boots. But like I said, these are great looking boots. I really like the way Tecobas does their inner lining because it's real comfortable. You don't have any uncomfortable uh, stitching on the side that may hurt you know, the bottom of your leg or may scratch up against there. So the pricing on these boots were $375, and I do think that they're real worth it. That's another thing about Tacovas that I like, is that a lot of their boots run at a fair price. There has been a couple of price increases, but overall, the whole industry, pricing is going up, guys. So if you really want these boots, don't delay on getting them, because they probably will run out pretty soon. So guys, let me know in the comments down below if you like these boots, if you like the fact that Tacovas is giving away free boot socks now, if you like the belt buckle, or if you would buy the belt to match your boots when you originally buy them. And that's gonna be it for now. So thank you guys for watching, and until next time, bye you guys.